Now, local sports with Roger Wallace. Good evening. Suddenly, their game with UT, not a big deal for the University of Wyoming football team. This morning, 19-year-old backup linebacker Ruben Narcisse was killed in a car accident. There were four Wyoming players in the car. Receiver C.J. Morgan is still in the hospital, while J.J. Quinlan and Trey Fox have been released. The driver of the car apparently fell asleep. Now, Narcisse listed on the depth chart, number four, at the middle linebacker position. He did not play Saturday in their win against Southern Utah. Turning to the Longhorns now, well, little did they know on this play, Cody Johnson sprained his ankle. He worked so hard to get to the starting running back job, he didn't tell coaches. And in fact, now is probably not even going to practice tomorrow. So Trey Newton has moved up to the number one running, on the, running back on the depth chart. He did score three touchdowns. Longhorns, of course, beat Rice 34-17. Not nearly the spread a lot of people anticipated. Max not worried about the spread, just worried about some mistakes that left a bad taste in his mouth. I left the stadium mad, which I'm too old to do that. Um, and it, it, it was mad over the same things you all saw that you're mad about. It was the obvious. And what you see is that... Uh, uh, most of what she did is really good. We missed opportunities all over the place, so the score wasn't what anybody wanted, which really is unimportant. The win's what's important. I got a little bit anxious before the game, and I was, you know, a little bit nervous. And I think I think that was a good thing. Um, it was something that I didn't feel all of last year, so it was good to get that feeling back going into the game. And then, um, but after that first snap, I got settled down. Six o'clock, they'll honor Austin's first response unit. Of course, 9-11 is their next game against Wyoming. Express season ended today. They lose. Okay, Roger.